Hey everyone, are you sick and tired of dragging your gear through the thick, hot sand? Well, now there's an easier way to get all of your gear to the beach in just one trip with ease. Electric beach wagons like this e-beach wagon are becoming more and more popular. Most beach lovers want one, but they just don't understand why they cost so much. In this video, I'll help you understand why electric beach wagons are priced over $2,000, and I'll even help you justify the cost to your loved ones if needed. Before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Guys, if you're like me, you also serve as the family mule when it comes to getting all your gear down to the beach. When you have little ones, it's not an easy task. Well, an e-beach wagon will take all of your troubles away. Simply press the thumb throttle and have the wagon do all of the work. You can carry up to 300 pounds of stuff in this bad boy. And with our new rack accessory, you have more room in your wagon because some of the bulky gear is carried outside the wagon. If you're just discovering electric beach wagons, you might be scratching your head thinking, why do they cost so much? I'm going to break down the cost of all the components to help you understand the price point a bit more. To start, our wagon has four 12-inch low-pressure polyurethane balloon wheels. Wheelies are the name brand wheels, and you can see from their website that one 12-inch wheel is $95. With shipping to the East Coast, you're looking at $428 for a set of four. We went with a less expensive alternative that functions just as well as the wheelies wheels on the sand. To make your wagon stop and go, you'll need an electric motor and brake. MonsterScooterParts.com has many options that are made for mobility scooters, which is about the speed and power that you'll need. Let's assume you go with an assembly that includes the motor, brake, and transaxle. Here's a reasonably priced option for $323. The other electrical components needed are a controller, throttle, on-off switch, forward reverse switch, battery charging port, USB charging port, batteries, and a charging cord. When you add all those components up, your subtotal is $984. And we haven't even talked about the frame or the other custom fabricated parts needed to bring everything together. On our e-beach wagon, our patent pending frame and railing design is what really sets us apart. Our frame consists of rectangular and round aluminum tubing with welds at each of the intersecting points. The vertical round tubes in the corners serve as umbrella or flagpole holders on the beach. Simply remove the railing, grab your umbrella pole, stick it through the hole, and you're ready to go. It doesn't get much easier than that. Our railings are made of bent aluminum tubes with welded rectangular supporting tubes and real wood slats with weatherproof coating. There are 70 welds between the frame and railings, which are all done by hand, so there is a significant labor cost to consider. With this patent pending design, you really won't find a better looking wagon on the market. The wagon bed is made of plastic and can easily be removed to access the electrical and mechanical enclosure box or to give the wagon bed a deep cleaning. The mold alone to make this plastic wagon bed was $20,000. There's also a control panel up front that is made of plastic as well, which organizes your controls very nicely. Underneath the wagon are all custom fabricated steel components. You have the electrical and mechanical enclosure box, the steering assembly, and detachable handlebar. Everything is powder coated for a beautiful finish. You may now begin to understand why our e-beach wagon is priced over $2,000. If not, I challenge you to find a fabricator who will do it for less. But that's not all. We also need to package the wagon and ship it to our customers. Each wagon comes mostly assembled in a giant box that is three quarters of an inch thick. That box is strapped to a pallet, which isn't free either. We have nearly $100 in packaging costs alone. And finally, anyone who runs a business understands the overhead costs associated with that. We have costs for warehousing, product development, which was done by talented engineers in the USA, insurance, logistics, marketing, a one-year warranty, and the list goes on and on and on. By now, you should be thinking that the price of our wagon is a steal, but maybe you need to convince your loved ones that it's worth the investment. One way to do that is by putting it in perspective compared to other products out there. How about this Louis Vuitton bag that is about 10 inches by eight inches by three inches and costs $2,570? Guys, if your wife has one of these, it should be an easy win. Just ask her how much beach gear she can carry with this bag. Now let's look at some other wagons out there without motors. 
Take this special edition wonderful wagon stroller for $1,599. They don't have low pressure balloon wheels, so good luck pushing them through the thick sand. Or how about these Phoenix beach buggies ranging from $1,245 to $1,730? They do have low pressure balloon wheels, but no motor, so you still have to push it to the beach and back. Okay, but what about items that are a little more similar in that they have a motor and battery? Check out this one wheel starting at $2,200. I'm sure it's a blast, but come on, it only has one wheel and we have four. These e-foils are really cool. It's like a hovering surfboard that you can ride through the water. This Lift 4 model will run you nearly $12,000. How about e-bikes? If you do a quick search on Google, you'll see there are numerous options in the $1,000 to $3,000 price range. And finally, feel free to check out our competition. There are two other companies making electric beach wagons right now. One is the Sandhopper, and the other is the Electric Big Kahuna Wagon. Prices do fluctuate from time to time, so I'll let you do your own research on those wagons. Do be sure though to complete an apples to apples comparison. Our e-beach wagon comes with tall railings, eight built-in pole holders, and USB charging ports standard. Come see why our customers are giving us raving Google reviews. We would love to see you on the beach with an e-beach wagon. Well, thank you for watching this video. I hope you can now understand why electric beach wagons are priced over $2,000. We understand that they're not for everyone. If you're not in the market to buy one, please consider renting one for your next vacation. Check out our rental page for rental providers we work with. If you don't see someone that services your area, contact your local beach gear rental company and ask them to offer e-beach wagons. All right, until next time, go enjoy the beach.